Torito. Feeling extra relaxed today on day four because we just got back from having a deep tissue 75 minute massage. They had a really good special. I'm actually gonna show you it because I think I still have it saved. Um, it had like a hot stone accompaniment and then um, she was able to do a couple's room for us. So me and Chris got to do it together. And then today, Mama Bee also had a special same, same deal, same massage, 75 minute hot stone and all that jazz. Mm -hmm. Um, but that was for her to say thank you for planning this whole trip. We wanted to do something special for her. So we just did that, had some hot dogs at the boardwalk again. And then today's a later port day. So we're not porting till about 2.30. And we'll have a walking tour in San Juan, Puerto Rico. We just actually are docking right now. It looks like I can't show you the price because I don't want my mom to know how much it costs. But it was a great deal. And this is what you got, full body hot stone full body skin brushing, foot and ankle massage, and hand and arm massage, and it was amazing. <laughs> a beautiful walking tour through San Juan, Puerto Rico, through all the historic spots in the area, including this beautiful 16th century castle, Castillo San Felipe del Morro. Many historic battles were fought here. You'll be able to see where the cannons were positioned. So many things are left in its original state and you get to walk through the entire property and this was definitely the highlight of the tour for us. We absolutely loved getting to explore. we were walking back to the start of the tour we saw a bunch of cats and our tour guide was telling us that they roam the streets often and you'll even see them on top of cars and we did happen to see that as we were walking through as well and we just thought it was so funny and so cute to see them all over the streets then we went to Raices and this is supposed to be a really good authentic um, experience when it comes to food here in Puerto Rico so we definitely got our grub on here had some mufungo and some croquetas, some really yummy traditional food, plus some pina coladas all around. Oh, hi. <laughs> Good job, everyone. We've got mofongo, this is steak. 
a shrimp one, some, what's this? Coquetas. Coquetas. And some kind of fried cheese. Frito misto. We came back to a cute little penguin, at least I think that's what he is. Very dang cute. For dinner, we went to the Hibachi Izumi, and this is part of the dining package. We absolutely loved it here. It was such a great experience, and the food was delicious. And if we had more time, we wanted to explore all the restaurants on the ship, but if we had another chance, we would 100% come back to this restaurant. Wow. <laughs> Don't be shy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, a little flower board. Uh, this out gonna be a no makeup vacation day and I don't think I told you guys yesterday but pretty much all day yesterday was a no makeup day and I'm loving it <laughs> I just wear glasses it's way too sweaty it's like we're walking around everywhere and don't get me wrong I'm not complaining because it actually was really beautiful yesterday with the wind and everything in Puerto Rico but it's allowing me to get a little sun I'm wearing sunscreen don't worry and I just wear my sunglasses but I did my hair in some little braids today because I just wanted to get it out of my face. And this dress I got off of Rent the Runway. I'll leave the information down below, but I love it. It's perfect for this kind of atmosphere. We're going to St. Thomas today, so we've got palm trees and hibiscus flowers and all kinds of fun um, tropical theme going on here. And then this bag has been the best to travel with and so easy because I have it around, I'll, I'll have it around my chest, like in front of me. So I feel like it's really secure. It's It would be pretty difficult for someone to take something from me. Um, plus it's cute and stylish. All right, uh, also, also I love these little sneakers. Mama B actually found them at Walmart and they have like a scrunchy back to them. So they're really comfortable and they're super lightweight. Um, and I walk, walked all day in Puerto Rico yesterday on cobblestone streets and everything, and they were really good support still for my ankle. So I'm gonna wear them again today with this dress, and I don't think it looks bad. I think it's pretty cute. So when we first got to St. Thomas, we went on a sky ride up to Paradise Point where you can see the entirety of St. Thomas. It is so beautiful up there. You'll see some great views here in a second, but the sky ride was actually really cool. top of Paradise Point there was a bar called Taste that we decided to have a few drinks at and just enjoy the beautiful view up there for a while. And then once we were back down um, at the shops we did enjoy buying a few souvenirs and looking through all the jewelry sales before heading back to the ship. We're starting out already full of yummies. This is a Paradise Punch. So we're about to go on this crazy slide, you guys. I'll try to film a little bit going down.
Once we set sail, we decided to try our hand at the mini golf, which was a pretty cool setup, I have to say. It was right next to the pool, and we had a great view of the ocean right next to us. It's pretty cool to be playing mini golf on the sea. And then we went to Izumi again, but on the sushi side, and we tried some of their sushi rolls and some fried rice, things of that nature. Everything was absolutely delicious again and we did end up calling it an early night. We just had a lot of sun that day and so much fun all day that we were knocked out. But I will see you guys again for the grand finale, the final vacation vlog.